Good afternoon. God bless you all. Like and subscribe. Look, America does not care about gay Africans. America does not care about African Americans in the United States. What the United States is trying to do is send a message to Russia and China saying that we control these people. They are ours. They do what we tell them to do. That is the message that America is trying to send by pushing this homosexual illiteracy to the continent of Africa. Judeo-Christians brought the Bible to Africa and it has been misused in Africa to colonize, pillage, rape, and murder. And America has killed their democratic leaders. You see, America is not a democracy. It is a plutocracy and has always been. When America gained freedom, from Britain, the only people who could vote were rich land owners. That is a plutocracy. All America is trying to do is show off. China has hurt America's ego. Russia has hurt America's ego. And what they're doing now with this gay, homosexual, perverted agenda is trying to push something on the continent of Africa that Africans do not want. It is very disrespectful. Very disrespectful. I do not tell my neighbor next door how to run his life. It is none of my business. Africa is thousands and thousands of miles away, and what they do in Africa does not concern the United States. Only thing the United States wants to do is exploit, is to continue the exploitation of Africa and hold them down. In fact, that's all America has done throughout the centuries is hold other countries back to hide their inferiority. As I said, America pushed Judeo-Christians, pushed so-called Christianity on Africans. Now, in the book, that's supposed to be representative of the United States and Christianity is the Bible. Let's go to Deuteronomy 22, verse 5, and let's what the, see what the Bible says about homosexuality. It says, The woman shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man, neither shall a man put on a woman's garment, for all that do so are abomination unto the Lord thy God. Deuteronomy 22 verse 5. Let me read it to you again to make sure you understand it. It's not secretive. There's nothing. There's no hidden message in it. It reads, The woman shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man. Neither shall a man put on a woman's garment, for all that do so are abomination unto the Lord thy God. So are you going to read the Bible and believe it or not? Or do you think this has some kind of hidden message in it? Ooh, no, it doesn't. 
No, it does not. It's plain. And it's talking about homosexuality. And it calls it an abomination. And when you look at the history of America, that is also abomination. Built on the colonization and exploitation of resources and sex of indigenous people. So let's not play games here. The United States is trying to show Russia and China that I tell these people what to do and I treat them the same way I treat African Americans in my country. I have my foot on their necks. That's the message that America is sending. And they are threatening African countries if they do not bow to their satanic will. I mean, they're not pushing civil rights. They're pushing gay rights. And common sense should tell the people of Africa, if America is not willing to give civil rights and pay represent and pay reparations to African Americans for the building of this country, then common sense tells them they do not give a crying anything about the people of Africa. This isn't even this isn't, isn't even about the people of Africa. It's about world domination. It's about world domination from a sick and demented country that calls its, uh, itself a democracy and is actually a plutocracy and created laws, campaign finance laws to allow the plutocracy to flourish and profit off of its own people. Off of its own people. I mean, common sense is common sense. Reality is reality. With that, um, have a nice day. God bless. Like and subscribe, because I got to get this message out. Because it's obvious to me that uh, when one of my uh, videos blew up to over 4,000, all of a sudden, the rest of them was pretty much spoke on, spoke in the, spoke on the same subject, went in the same direction. All of a sudden, they became invisible. So like and subscribe. And um, if, you have, if you have a Facebook account, Post my videos on Facebook. Other than that, see you around. Have a great day. And uh, God bless us all.